Hey curl friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today, despite my hot curl summer shirt, it's fall and we are gonna be doing a Halloween look. As you guys know, I'm a strong advocate of not straightening your hair for special occasions or holidays like Halloween. Are you really gonna risk heat damage after you spent this whole year deep conditioning, using legit products, getting your curls moisturized just to suck all the moisture out of it for one Halloween party? Do you even have plans? You're not gonna straighten your hair for the gram, are you? So I would just you know, like to suggest doing curly versions of whatever Halloween costume you wanna do. For example, today I'm going to be Daphne from Scooby-Doo and she has orange straight hair. I'm gonna be the curly version of Daphne. Let's get started. So in order to get this orangey look, I'm gonna be using the Hair Makeup by Curlsmith, of course. Today's video is sponsored by Curlsmith, so thank you for sponsoring yet another Halloween video. If you haven't seen my previous Curlsmith Halloween videos, go watch those for more inspo for this year's costume. But I'm gonna be using the Curl Recipe in the color Copper to give me that orange look. Now you guys might have seen me use these a million times, but you usually see me use these on soaking wet hair. But today I'm gonna do a refresh on day, I don't know, day four curls and show you the difference. So let's see what we're working with today. Here we are, oh wow. This is scary enough for Halloween. We could just go out like this and scare some people. Let's start off with some water. So I'm, I'm going to re-wet it. Oof. And I'm gonna start off with the Curlsmith Weightless Air Dry Cream, my favorite leave-in conditioner because it's very lightweight. Uh, it does give my hair a lot of moisture. It smells amazing. Now the main reason I want to do this on refreshed hair is because I want my hair to be really big and my hair is usually bigger and best on like day three, day four. Because I really know how to refresh. I have, I think I can say that I've mastered the refresh. So I say I don't want it soaking wet, but it kind of just like happens. That's enough. Smoothing in that water, smoothing down any frizz, getting my length back. And now let's put some more water on this side. I also want my hair to be very orange, like potent. So if you want like a more natural, like you just got your hair like a, a light brown copper look, you can use this definitely on soaking wet hair and you'll get like a lighter effect. But if you want it to be very pigmented, then it actually looks best or works best on dry hair. And it is a gel, so it's not just color, it's a styler and it's a really good one at that. I'm gonna be first using my leave-in conditioner because you use your leave-ins before your gels. Let's go ahead and use a little dollop of this. You don't have to use a leave-in conditioner first with these colors, but I think it's probably best to give your hair some moisture before you put it on. Especially if you want to continue to rock the color for a couple days, because it does last, you can sleep on it, it doesn't ruin your bed or pillowcases, it doesn't stain anything. So you want to add in that moisture so you can have your style last throughout the week. There's that. Now I'm gonna add some more on this side, like so. I really wanna get these ends. That's where your hair is usually the driest. Probably do a middle part. I think she has a middle part. Okay, there we go. So now my hair is slightly damp, but not soaking wet. So I'm gonna start applying the color. <laughs> this part's so fun. All right, let's do this. This is the Color Copper Temporary Color Styling Gel Rinses in One Wash, easy peasy. I've done it a million times. I'm going to... Uh... <laughs> I get so excited every year, like I haven't done this a million times. But I'm going to rub it in. Look at this color. It's so pigmented and like metallic. Now you could do this in sections. You know I'm really bad at sections. I should do it in sections. You know where it's gonna... Oh! That first, that first dollop is everything. <laughs> so fun, so fun. Paint it all on there. I'm gonna use a lot today, guys. I want it to be orange, orange. Not even copper, but orange. I'm gonna do just like a light coat. I say light and I add a bunch. But 
it goes on even more pigmented on dry hair. So I'm just gonna use this just kind of like to style my curls and then I'm gonna add more when it dries for more color. So this is just gonna be like my, my normal gel base, adding it on like it's just a gel styler which it is a very good styler for being a color styler. It's like being able to see exactly where you're putting product and what curls didn't get any. So let me tell you about this hair color and why it really does stand out from other hair colors. The ingredients, it has super natural ingredients. I'm talking about apricot, orange peel, pumpkin, and carrot. Like literally a fruit salad is what was made to make this no sulfates, no parabens, no silicones, vegan, cruelty-free, like just an all-around good product. You do not need gloves, even though it looks like it, but this rinse is off, no problem. It does not stain your nails, even though mine are already orange, but I've done this a million times and haven't had any problems. Even if it gets on your clothes, it rinses off. I mean, it's apricot and carrot. That alone already looks cute. Like if you want like a subtle copper, light brown vibe, you could stop right here. But I'm gonna add a little bit more to these ends. Get some on the top. Another thing that I love about this gel is that it dries pretty quickly. Cause I have low porosity hair, my hair takes forever to dry, but this does a really good job at just getting to that hold level sooner than later. I'm going to dry this now. Let it air dry for a little bit and then I'm gonna come back and diffuse, and then we add more. <laughs> and I'm back. It's only been like maybe 10 minutes and my hair is already like getting to a nicely defined state because I didn't start off on soaking wet hair and this gel does dry pretty quickly. So now I'm going to diffuse it, get it completely dry, make it as big as possible, and we'll see how it looks. So now we're, we're getting there volume wise. I'm gonna keep diffusing, but let's add some more color. Going back in with my copper and you can see how more pigmented it is on dry hair. I'll do one side at a time so you can really see. There we go. That is how copper I want it to be. Oh yeah. Do not forget the back of your head. Alrighty, I am now satisfied with my amount of copperness. It looks so pretty. I really shouldn't just wait till Halloween to do these colors, like, I have such a fun time every single time. Now, even though I'm gonna be Daphne, that is just one option that you could do with this copper. You could be Wilma from the Flintstones. I was Chucky Finster. I was Kim Possible. You could be Mirda from Brave. I was also Miss Bellum from Powerpuff Girls. The list continues. So you can do a bunch of different fun, like redhead costumes with this look. I Love Lucy, that'd be a good one. Leave some other suggestions down below. Now I could leave it like this because she does have straight hair, but I kind of want it to be a little bit bigger because that's just me. Let's do it. Oh yes. So bomb. I think we're good now. We're just gonna pick it out a little bit. Cause you guys, this is not just a color that you have to put on top of a gel or your stylers. It's a styler on its own. So that's why my curls, like, they're not just a color, they're defined. And they look so good. Don't you think? Now let me become full on Daphne. Add some accessories. Now technically, she has bangs, so I probably should have done fake bangs. But let's just do a little like fake side swoop bang situation. Maybe like that. 
And then put the headband. Well, that's cute. I like that. And then we have our little scarf. Oh my goodness. How fabulous. How fabulous are we with just a little bit of accessories? You can't tell me that this isn't cuter than a basic Daphne costume. This is just so... Guys, look at this. You can't tell me that the straight hair would look better. You just can't. Oh, now I need plans. I have no plans. Who wants to invite me somewhere? So this look is adorable, but there's only one way to make it even more adorable. It's Scooby-Doo! Say hi, Jalen. Hi, Jalen. <laughs> Say hi, curl friends. Oh, look what you already wanted to show them how to use your pick. Wow. Look how cute. There you have it. The cutest costumes of all time. Just so you guys know, all the Curlsmith hair makeup colors are now on sale. Tomorrow's actually the last day. So if you buy two, you get one free. Ooh. And if you've never purchased from the Curlsmith website before, you also can get 10% off using my promo code. As you can see, Curlsmith has multiple colors aside from copper. They have ruby, turquoise, rose gold, and a gold. Which one do you like, Jalen? Pink, blue, red, or orange? Uh. Orange! Good choice, because that's what's in mommy's hair today. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today. 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 <laughs>